Hi, I'm Marissa Mitchery. I'm Ashlyn Lally, and we write for the SHS Courier. We interview people based on their favorite Netflix shows. And here are their responses. My favorite show is Freaks and Geeks. My favorite show is Malcolm in the Middle. My favorite show is Squid Game. That 70s show. My favorite show is Young and Hungry. New Girl. Grey's Anatomy. Breaking Bad. Oh, my favorite show is All American. My favorite show is Big Mouth. My favorite Netflix show is Stranger Things. My favorite show is On My Block. It's my favorite show because it brings back childhood memories and it makes me giggle. I just really like it because it's kind of like throwback aesthetic and I just wish it was alive back then. It's very action-packed and suspenseful. I like Freaks and Geeks because it explores the culture of high school in the 80s and all the characters are super fun. I really like this show because it's super funny and the main character makes really dumb decisions and it's just very entertaining watching it. My favorite part about New Girl is the character development, drama, and Megan Fox in season five. Um, it's my favorite show because it's interesting watching like life or death situations and watching the characters like grow and develop. Breaking Bad is my favorite show because it has an extremely interesting plot. I like the show because it brings humor to an awkward period of like children's lifetime. I like this show because it shows the difference in the diversities and the different lives of how we are affected in different environments. It's my favorite show because it deals with real world issues and it's funny. I like that show because it's based in the 80s and I think the time period is pretty cool and also I like the plot because it's very like paranormal and mysterious. Malcolm in the Middle is about a dysfunctional family with four sons, one which is really smart, and three delinquents. So it's about a bunch, a, a group of friends, and they just live throughout the 70s doing a bunch of like activities and stuff. It's about a bunch of people who go into a game to win money because they're in debt, and it's a life or death situation. Freaks and Geeks is about the freaks and the geeks in high school and it's just like funny little stuff. The show is about a young chef named Gabby who develops a relationship with her boss who just employed her and there's just a lot of ups and downs in the relationship and it's just very entertaining and very It's good. about a woman who moves into an apartment with three other guys and it's about their life. Um, it's about workers at a hospital and they all have like drama between each other while they're still trying to keep people alive and there's just like a lot of plot to it. That is about a teacher who gets diagnosed with cancer and he tries to make a living off of making meth and it gets really intense. The show is about um, teaching kids about their development but like in a humorous way. So All American is about um, this kid who's recruited to a very high maintenance school and he's given the chance to be All American. He's taken under the wing of uh, someone named Billy Baker who knows his father, who actually went to school with his father, so he's uh, trying to like take him in to help him see that life is more about football, but also life is football. It's about uh, how four kids get through high school and like their challenges. Um, the show is about a group of teenagers who gets involved with a bunch of mysterious and paranormal things inside their town and it's kind of like up to them to figure out all the mysteries.